Ethereum experienced a significant decline in its price, leading to a corresponding decrease in profit support. Uh, on the 2nd of January, Ethereum faced a notable decrease of over 6%, settling at about 22.10 based on a daily time frame chart. The chart analysis showed a positively start to the year with some intermittent declines up to the 2nd of January. Uh, however, the most recent dip marked the steepest drop observed in the past few weeks. Uh, additionally, this price drop caused the relative strength index to fall below the neutral line. As of this writing, the RSI remained below the line despite a slight uptick for in the price. Uh, the price was around 2,230 with less than a 1% increase as of this writing. Also, the short moving average yellow line continued to act as support for now. Nevertheless, this support could shift if the price falls below the existing range. Then surprisingly, Ethereum witnessed increased outflows on the 3rd of January, even in the face of a declining price. Leading up to this date, there was a prevailing trend of inflows signifying a greater influx of ETH into exchanges for potential sale. However, this pattern shifted on the 3rd of January with over 22,000 ETH leaving exchanges. The net flow on exchanges remains positive, albeit marginally, indicating a higher sales volume. Uh, it is notable that at press time there was no evident indication of an imminent sell-off uh, the impact of the price decline extended to the Ethereum supply and profit and the crypto's analysis of the supply and profit on sentiment showed a significant reduction in the volume of ETH that was in a profitable position. And uh, before the 3rd of January, uh, the supply and profit was over 110 million ETHs after uh, constituting over 84% of the total supply. Uh, is your portfolio green? Check out the ETH profit calculator. However, by the conclusion of the day, on the 3rd of January, uh, this figure had decreased to around 107 million, accounting for about 82% of the supply. Uh, um, as of this writing, um, the supply and profit had further reduced to um, uh, around 104 million, representing about 79% of the total supply.